So United, who is now a $2.25 chance for the Tab Canberra Cup coming up. Any last thoughts here, Graham? Oh, made the best horse win, Ali. You just want everything to have a trouble-free run, don't you? You know, the crowd lying the fence here. This is one of the biggest crowd uh, Canberra's had, they've told me today, the club officials. They were expecting a big crowd up towards 10,000. I'll tell you what, they'll give it a nudge. So this is a great starting point. They'll send out a really big cheer here, Ali, but on with So United to uh, give the Waterhouse Stable another victory in the feature race. I actually walked to the horse stalls before a couple of times and I couldn't get through the crowd. There were that many and all really young as well. It's quite a young demographic today, which yeah, is great it is. to see. Yeah, and a big holiday here tomorrow, so they'll party on for a while and you can see some of those crowd shots there now. They're staying the pack of minutes. They're locked away here for our feature event. One of our feature events, the Tab Canberra Cup. As 1A completes the line, so United. 225, 5 to 4 in the old red jacket. Runs favourite Tim Clark. Ready. They're off. So United broke well and goes to the early lead. Almania was away fast. 1A coming across from Lord Ardmore. Then came El Largo from Redstone Well. Regal Lion is back second last and Royal Robbins is the last one. So United finds the lead out of the home straight. 1,800 metres left to go. Almania got to second. Lord Ardmore leaders back in third and Redstone Well's in fourth position. Then came El Largo from 1A. Regal Lion is second last and Royal Robbins is the last one. So it's So United in front. 1,400 metres left to go. Into the back straight by a length to Almania in second position. Lord Ardmore's in third. Redstone Wells in fourth. El Largo fifth in the local mayor. 1A from Royal Robbins and Regal Lion is the last one. So United. Midway down the back straight. Still a length in front to Almania second. Lord Ardmore third. Redstone Wells in fourth. El Largo fifth then came 1A. Royal Robbins and Regal Lion. There's been no change to the order. As they work their way off the back they've run halfway now. 1,000 metres left to go. And the leader, So United, from Almania in second position. Lord Ardmore third. Redstone Wells in fourth. Then El Largo, 1A. Royal Robbins. And the last one was Regal Lion. So they're approaching the 650. And it's So United in front from Almania. Redstone Well popped out three wide. Lord Ardmore just waiting on a run on the back of the leader. Then came 1A. She's tracking up at the right time. And Regal Lion gets to the outside. So United. United. Almania on the scene very quickly at the top of the straight and Almania ran to So United. Redstone well running on. Almania hit the front 200 out from So United who's very brave. Then Redstone well. Almania in front. 100 to go from So United. Redstone well. Almania's in front from So United. Redstone well. Almania for the Tab Canberra Cup. Almania won it. Second Redstone well. Third So United. Fourth came Lord Ardmore. They're followed by Regal Law. Lion further back to Royal Robbins, then El Largo, and 1A last. A tough win there from Almania, who had to tough it out with the on-pacer, so united, but gets the job done for Chris Lees and defies a bit of a drift in the market there at 380. Redstone well was brave. He looked gone and then kicked back at $1.60, and the favourite, so united, has run third there on the rail, Lord Ardmore in for fourth. Yeah, that's his second win in the race, too. He won it with Mugger 2 back in 2020 with Kieran McAvoy today, but uh, today Dylan Gibbons in the saddle working overtime to get this well-supported runner to the line. Uh, so united it was really gallant to defeat and I thought the eight ran a terrific race there Ali uh, Redstone well finishing off really well for Tom Sherry so a good effort by our winner continues to progress it beat most of these home at a slater start there in the Parramatta Cup and this was raced by a big syndicate of owners headed by Australian Bloodstock uh, it's record that's his third win only his third win this eight year old so they've had to be patient this one by Australia out of a mere course sent from heaven its name is Almania and it's the winner of our Canberra Cup and of course for Australian Bloodstock they also owned Mugger 2, so no doubt a sentimental win for them. He was a fan favourite and a stable favourite Mugger 2, and I think we'll follow Redstone well out of that run as well. He'll just improve and be even better in his second preparation in Australia. So our winner, Almania, over Redstone well, and so United has run third there. That takes us away from Canberra. We're off to the sunny coast.